Warning, the following story contains graphic material. Viewer discretion is advised. Oh, what was the number again? I can't see that far. Uh. You see, now this is the very reason why I've been thinking about it for all these years, and now I'm finally gonna go through with it laser eye correction. Sorry, I couldn't see what number it was, so I didn't type it in. I went through the consultation, and I'm a prime candidate. Based on the fact that my eyes are shaped like rugby balls, it means I have an astigmatism. For years, the eye doctors have told me I'm nearsighted, which basically means you'll have to come nearer to the television set so I can see you. But I am rather concerned about this refractive surgery, the idea of an ophthalmologist and high-tech laser equipment removing the outer flap of my cornea so they can reshape the way I receive light is kind of daunting. But it's the results that interest me. Imagine being able to see clearly. I'm sick of glasses and done with the contacts. I want to break free from the shackles of visual aid. And I want to be able to hit a golf ball and see it go into the rough. See why I can't wear glasses? I'm not sure why I'm so worried. The procedure's been around for 20 years. I've given it time to develop. I've had friends and acquaintances tell me it's the best thing they ever did. I also found out that 30 million people worldwide have had it done. And based on surveys that I found online, 98% of them were happy. Yes, I had it done. I can make out every little detail of every little window. And no, it's the greatest money I've ever spent. Um, for people who've got uh, myopia or anything like that, it's, it's night and day. Your, your quality of life is just so much better, so. What really blew me away is that the operation on each eye is less than 60 seconds. Oh no, I mean, it's over in like 10 seconds. You feel kind of ripped off. It's 14 seconds and you're like, I paid $4,000 for this. Myopia is very good laser. It's, it's good? Very fast, fast. Very and you're fast. a doctor? Yes. Oh, oh thank <laughs> goodness. Yes. There was a nose and throat doctor's convention in Vancouver yes. and a busload of them are right here yes. and we've got access to them. That's right. Yes, that's right. Uh, I do a lot of laser surgery in the throat actually. On a scale of 1 yeah. to 10, how much confidence do you have in modern laser technology? Well, um, I would say 10 depending on the laser and depending on the application. Uh, certainly in my field, laser is a very mature technology. Both daughters had it and the verdict is? Oh, they, they loved it. They'd do it again in a minute. But I'm also aware of some of the potential downsides. Dry eye syndrome, infections, corneal scarring, traumatic flap dislocation. Ooh. Laser lasts a long time, and, but it's painful, really painful to, to get one. Painful? It is, it is. My mom had it done, and uh, she actually has problems seeing at night. How long ago did she have it done? Oh, probably 10 years ago, at least. Uh, blurred vision, perhaps, or some light flashing. And a friend of mine, her father's an ophthalmologist, and even he's still feeling like the technology isn't quite where it needs to be. I'm a little uncomfortable with it still. So a lot of people get, get freaked out because for the first couple months of night vision, they, uh, there's a little bit of haloing with lights, so you'll kind of feel like, oh, they did something wrong, but no, it goes away, give it a couple months, it's, it's completely natural, it goes away, so. Your brother's had My it. brother has had it. How is he now? Very good. Is he in stable condition? He's in stable condition, <laughs> and he threw away his glasses. You got coverage? Yeah. Oh, then, yeah, go for it. What are you worried about? Well, the laser. The laser? <laughs> the laser in your retina? Yeah. Yeah? You need a doctor with a good equipment, a good experience, of course. If you guys have any laser eye testimonials for me, let me know on Twitter. You can find me at ShawTVJames. <laughs> Hopefully I'll see you later, and a lot more clearly. Okay. I think that's a letter P. Could be wrong, though. <laughs>